Hey guys, Mars Thinking here bringing you another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video. And so I asked you guys uh, in the stream when we collected the World Tournament rewards uh, if you wanted to see me do this. Uh, we'll, be, we'll be finding out now whether it was a waste of orbs. But I have rainbowed the World Tournament reward Trunks. Uh, he's a Movie Heroes support unit. So we're going to jump in to an event with the Movie Heroes team and uh, see how he can hold up. So he does supreme damage with his super attack with a medium chance to stun. Uh, his passive is attack and defense 70%, changes physical key spheres to rainbow, uh, medium chance of evading the enemy's attack, which is 25%, and then he gives movie heroes, category allies, two key, attack 20%, and defense 10%. Now, the biggest problem with this guy being on movie heroes is the fact that his only real good link partners are other Trunks's, uh, future Gohan, um, and then we start to get into some of the other Z fighters, like there's some Gohans that have Z fighters and Saiyan lineage. Um, none of those characters that I've mentioned are on Movie Heroes. Um, so this is the team that we've built. We're going to be showing him off, even though he's a support unit, I'm going to try and keep him on main rotation. But we're going to keep floating around the units that we have on rotation with him. Because, I mean, you can see from this starting turn, he has no links with um, Gogeta at all, apparently. So... I do want him to super attack, but will we get enough orbs to drop down? Because I, I do want Gogeta to super attack as well, but... Uh, no, we won't. Okay, great. He's got a cool sprite, though. I really do like the movie Bojack uh, Trunks design. Um, and his super isn't a key blast super either, so he would have actually been able to deal damage to him. But I guess we're not going to do it. So, the side thing, because we're showcasing him, he is a support unit. So one thing we are going to get to see the benefit of, of, of course, is the effect that he has on the other units around him. So Rainbow Gogeta, obviously 1.7 million, not necessarily a crazy attack stat to see from him. But I guess the main thing to bear in mind is he has no links active. Um, so, yeah, we're going to see as we float the other units around. We'll see who comes onto the rotation, see who he has any links with. Uh, Spirit Bomb Goku, the Go Bros. And uh, we'll see if we can actually get any links active for him. But obviously, we've got this movie hero support Gohan as well, who I want to float off. Um, so when while he's floating around, obviously he'll be providing support. Um, so he'll be buffing the trunks a little bit, and then we can we can actually see him super attack. So uh, I'm going to deliberately get the 12 key super with Goku here, so we get the. Um, get the defense raise and then I'm not going to super with Gohan because he does have a key blast super attack so obviously the Gobros do as well but we put them first so he's already on full health anyway and then two additional normals that's perfect so you can actually deal damage to him and uh, then Spirit Bomb Goku comes in not bad mine has two dupes so he's pretty solid and of course the movie support Gohan is on this rotation so nice big buff for him and then Gohan takes him out. So that's perfect. Now we get these first two stages out of the way. We don't have to worry about it. Because we now have uh, no need to worry about Key Blast super attacks. So I do want these two together. But we'll have to get the other rotation set up as the uh, Gogeta rotation. So actually we'll go ahead and put Trunks in the first slot. And see how he does here with no support. So he has 53k defense. Not the best, but he does have the 25% chance to dodge, so we'll see if that comes in. I mean, technically it's the same chance Gogeta has before he transforms, so... Yeah, let's see uh, how this goes. So no support, no no links active, basically. Uh, 680k. Super attack not bad, we get the crit, hey, and we get the additional as well. I do like the uh, flip kick at the beginning, pretty cool. Um, 37k, okay. He didn't dodge either of the attacks, so... Because, <laughs> yeah, obviously you're going to be using him as a third slot uh, floating unit if you use him on this team. Um, so he'll be providing key and a buff to the rest of the rotation. But he's not really going to be doing a lot himself. Um, which is interesting because, as I said at the beginning, he's got some good link partners. But that you'd have to run him on a non-movie heroes team. Like on a hybrid Saiyans team, um, you could get some really good link partners for him. And have some support you know, units alongside him. But then... Yeah, he's a support unit, not really supporting anyone on the team. He gets the buffs himself, which is good, I suppose. But, yeah, let's float off the Spirit Bomb Goku first. We'll try him out as a uh, rotation partner. 
and then we'll give you guys all of these, and I guess we'll just get those. So we'll probably do a pretty significant amount of damage to uh, 17 this turn, I think. Because that's the thing, right? Like, the Movie Heroes team is incredibly powerful. There's so many, like, crazy units on it, but they are one of those categories that is kind of lacking for really good support units. Like, the Movie Support Gohan that we bought is obviously a good one because he gives a 40% attack buff, but he is one of those support units that he himself is not particularly sturdy, so he can take a lot of damage, especially in the harder events. Um, and Trunks is going to be the same, especially because he's only a level 100 UR without an actual TUR Awakening yet. Um, so his defense is not going to be crazy high, but he does have the 25% chance to dodge. So, I mean, I give support units that can't take hits full dodge anyway, which is usually 15 or 20 if they're an int unit. But technically he has a 25 dodge. And then, of course, that's calculated separately. So if the 25% chance to dodge doesn't go off, uh, it will roll the level 5 dodge that he gets for being an int unit. So he gets a secondary 5% chance. So these two actually link up. They have Cold Judgment and Saiyan Lineage. Cold Judgment is a defensive link, actually. So, yeah, he's at 78 now. Um, does Gohan give a buff to defense as well? Yeah, it's attack and defense 40%. So obviously, next to Gohan, um, he's going to look pretty good. So I guess we can keep them together for now. And uh, whoever floats into the rotation next, if they activate any more of his links, we can put them, uh, maybe just put Trunks in the middle. So 25k, that's actually not too bad, because Android uh, 16 can do reasonable damage to you. Unfortunately, we're not getting uh, any of the dodges go off. And uh, sadly, in this mode, of course, we can't stun. So one of the things that's coming up as part of the thank you celebration, I will be doing a team building guide video that will probably come out on the day it all comes out. But there's... Uh, we're getting the new 10 stages of Category Super Battle Road, and uh, Movie Heroes is one of them. So it'll be interesting to see if this Trunks will be good on that team, because obviously if he can actually get those dodges off, that's going to come in really handy, and the buff to everybody else is super good. But I think he could do well on the team if you're just going to use items, because obviously support units definitely work in that kind of situation. But for me, when it comes to planning out the no item runs afterwards, uh, I don't think I would be using them on the team. But obviously with the caliber of awakenings that we've been seeing from world tournaments lately, this guy has the potential to be incredibly good once uh, he actually gets his awakening. So, All right, now we have the double Gogeta rotation in full effect. So... Gogeta can pop off. Mine has one dupe. Uh, my Gobros are rainbow. So, I mean, this is going to be a very strong rotation for this team. <laughs> Nine damage to Gogeta. I mean, if you're not going to trigger your 50% chance to dodge, you might as well just take nine damage. And then, yeah, guaranteed crit takes you out. <laughs> Overkill for the full Gogeta turn. Um, okay, so, do you guys activate any links at all? No. So yeah, might as well do this then again, I guess. Um, so we'll do this. Do this. We should see the same stats as last time, pretty much. Yeah. No, no extra support or anything. So um, yeah, let's get the uh, let's get the defense raise for Spirit Bomb Goku. So yeah, he doesn't hit a million attack stat, and that's with the other like the best support unit that we have on the rotation. And that's where the problem comes in, of course, of him not having a ton of these links active. So, and of course, we're seeing his, uh, has, he, has he actually dodged once yet? So, he's a support unit that can't take hits super well, and you can't really rely on the 25% chance to dodge going off. So, Gohan obviously taking a significant amount of damage there. Yeah, Spirit Bomb Goku should be fine. Thanks to double support units. Yeah, he raises his defense. So. so we will go ahead and heal up here. And then I think this turn will... Uh, this will be over rather quickly. And I, don't know, I don't think we're... I don't know if we're close enough to get the Dokkal attack with Trunks next turn. Which would be kind of funny. I mean, <laughs> getting the Dokkal attack with our support unit that has under a million attack stat. But... I guess we'll see. I mean, I'll potentially make the next one the last one. Um, trying to remember if it's the physical or tech cell next. Because if it's the physical one, we probably will take a fair bit of damage if his hits connect, which is uh, 
something to be slightly concerned about. So we'll, I guess next turn is potentially going to be the last turn either way, because we're going to see how well he does, and if he dies, then he dies. And that kind of shows him the way he naturally is in these kind of events. Obviously, you wouldn't normally be running him on main rotation, and like trying to put him in front of multiple attacks, but hey, we've actually got a tech unit as well, and he has no links with them either, so <laughs> he's basically got no links with anyone on the team that we're using, and it's very unfortunate, but yeah, I mean, very odd to have this particular trunks with this particular like link set be a movie hero support unit. I mean, it's cool that we have a Bojack movie trunks, because like I said, I really like his design, but Seems a bit weird to make him a movie hero's support unit, and then all of his best link partners are Trunks's and future Gohans who aren't movie heroes. <laughs> so, but yeah, he did pretty decently. We're not going to get the Dokkan attack with him, which means it would be pure destruction next turn. And of course, thanks to his support and the Gohan support, the Gobros are nearly a 7 million attack stat. So that is going to be his main use if you use him. He's going to be a support unit, but this was kind of just to show off... Uh, what he could do in the uh, right circumstances so let's go ahead and end off the video with the active skill why not since we're able to use it for the nice end screen as well so there you go that is going to be it for the video guys this has been the master ninja and let me know what you think of the movie support trunks down below in the comments was it a waste of orbs have you done anything with your one yet how many did you get let us know all of that down below in the comments section so smash like subscribe if you're new and i will see you guys in the next one have a good one